Talladega College announcing this afternoon it will implement a new plan to bring the institution into a better financial position. WVTM 13's Sherry Falk is joining us with more on how the college is trying to move past some financial decisions that have put them in kind of that tough position, Sherry. Yeah, Brittany, the college's interim president, along with the chairwoman of the Board of Trustees, delivered a state of the college address today after some recent concerns over the college's financial status. Now, back in June, there was an issue with employees not getting their paychecks on time. That was quickly resolved. However, not long after, the school's president resigned. Then in July, the HBCU announced that it did a financial review and decided, among other moves, to discontinue its women's gymnastics program, saying that it does not have the resources needed to support it. Now they're focusing on a four-step plan of recovery to bring the college back into good financial standing. When you go down to the basic foundation of anything and you are in the process of building back better, you're going to find out some things that were done and a lot have been done. We are committed to course correcting that. That's the only way we can ensure the long term sustainability of this institution. The school leaders say the financial issues stemmed from the decrease in enrollment over the past three years, and they will now focus on maintaining financial integrity and stability, academic excellence and accreditation, as well as recruitment and retention.